taking a paper towel and we're saying we, we're reconstructing it, we're going to make it in a smarter way. Inside this former Main Street credit union, workers stitch together what appears to be swatches of cotton cloth. But in fact, that cloth is a biofiber derived purely of wood pulp. This is about as environmentally responsible as a product as you're going to find in terms of sustainability. Uh, made from trees, the most abundant, fastest growing resource on earth. And it's a five spool. Mark Snyder uh, and Phil Pastore founded the company Globe Eco Maine just last summer. Already, their initial product, the Dura Fresh Cleaning Cloth, is sold in hundreds of stores. The secret they boast is all in the natural wood fiber, the same fiber that makes the cloth so durable. Does it smell? No. Nope. No, it doesn't. And it never will also keeps it smelling so fresh. This picks up germs off surfaces, rinse 99.9 percent .9 germ free. Not only do we see a dishcloth, but we see bridging that dishcloth to advanced composite materials, kind of sewn together in a quilt type fashion. Ultimately, Pastore envisions developing an entire line of made made products from biofiber. Right now, these rolls of finished fiber come from outside the United States, but the company has already teamed with a textile plant in nearby Guilford, which has the machines to make it and make it from Maine wool. Our vision is this is a whole new industry for the state of Maine. We're starting at the end where we're weaving, cutting, and sewing, and then we're going back to source our own trees to pulp. Hope is DuraFresh is helping to lay the foundation for the future of this main company, which, by all accounts, has managed to reconstruct the simple paper towel. So in the end game, you're using less material, you're getting more use out of it, and you're using the fastest replenishing, most abundant natural resource on earth to make an everyday item in every home to save people money. And right now, the company employs five workers with plans to double that by the end of the year. But once it starts sourcing its own trees for pulp, it foresees employing dozens of people. Wow, what a yeah. great idea. I love that.